Hey guys, welcome back to Sustain Ahoy. Today, we're going to show you how to make FPJ, also known as fermented plant juice. First, you'll need 1 to 2 pounds of raw brown sugar and 1 to 2 pounds of plant material. For this batch, I chose noni leaves. Step 2. Cut the plant material into 1 inch pieces. Hold up. Before we go any further, here's some tips on gathering your plant material. Tip 1. Choose a healthy plant to use that grows well in your area. You want to look for young shoots of fast growing plants. These healthy and fast growing plants should yield more FPJ. Here in Hawaii, we use native plants like hau, noni, and uala. Tip 2. Pick plant materials in the early morning when plants are in their respiration mode. The plant will have more vital nutrients during this time. Tip 3. Avoid rain or washing your plant material because they contain the surface microbes you need to help with the fermentation process. Now back to cutting. Step 3. Add equal parts of brown sugar and plant material. Step 4. Mix well. Step 5. Cover with a paper towel. Secure with some string or a rubber band. Step 6. Store in a cool place. The fermentation process takes about 5 to 7 days. Step 7. Extract the FBJ. It would have been better if I used a strainer, but oh well, just have to use what I have. Step 8. Bottle your FPJ. Make sure the cap is breathable as well. Store in a cool, dry location and not in the sunlight. Step 9. Application. 
Here I use the report I found online, which I provided down below in the description as a guide to diluting my FPJ for fertilizing my plants. For one to 500 parts dilution, I used eight milliliters of FPJ per gallon. But for one to 800 parts dilution, you'll need five milliliters of FPJ per gallon.